In this video, I'll show you how to surf live TV or the DreamLink live TV options with the TV guide and how to favorite channel. So let's begin. I'll click on my apps and in the add-on selection, click on DOL2, Dream Online 2. It's connecting to IPTV subs for me. It may connect to Rocket Streams for you or whatever your options are. It'll take me another five seconds for it to fully connect. And I'll show you some of the, the more common functions in which I use the DreamLink Live TV or DOL2 service. Now also noting that you won't see what's actually playing. I'm going to click OK so that the TV actually appears as a thumbnail on the right hand side. Now you won't actually see what's on TV right now uh, just because of the, the recording capabilities. So I'm going to show you that once you're in this screen, you can go down and click OK and it will show you what's playing in that thumbnail on the right hand side. If I want to pick ESPN UHD, I click OK and it will load on the right hand side. Now as you notice on the bottom screen there, there is a green button that says service search, there's a yellow button that says channel lock, and a blue button that says favorite. These correspond to the color buttons that are on your remote. The one I'm going to show you is the blue button, the favorite. Okay, so in this situation here, uh, actually before I show you how to favorite it, I'm going to click left on the remote and it will open up with the groups of TV stations that you can choose from. So right now I believe we're on the group that says sports. If I want to go to English, I click English. And here we have several stations that you can choose from. I can click the down arrow on the channel button on the remote and it will jump down by a group of channels. Okay, so it just so happens that HGTV is my family's favorite station. If I click OK, it'll play Fixer Upper on the right hand side. Now, if I go um, click the blue button on my remote, you'll see that the blue star appears next to the channel number. If I go up to, let's say, National Geographic Wild HD, and I click the blue button on my remote again, you'll see that there's a blue star that appears on the, beside the, the channel number. If I go left on a remote, the groups come on again. And if I surf up one to favorite and click favorite, you'll see all the different favorited channels, including the latest one that I favorited, which is the National Geographic Wild HD channel. So this is a great way to save time, to go to your favorites, save your favorite channels, and just only serve the ones that you want to watch. So now that I've shown you how to favorite channels, I want to show you the channel guide. If you look at the bottom of the screen, you'll see an EPG grid option. And if you click EPG on your remote, it's a button right in the middle of your remote that says EPG in blue. If you click on that, it will show you your TV guide, which is really, really slick. You can go left, you can go right, you can go down to the next channel, click OK, and the video thumb, the, the TV thumbnail will appear on the top left. I'm not seeing it right now. And if I click exit, it'll show the full screen. I click OK, it'll show the thumbnail on the right hand side. Right? And so that's basically how you surf through DreamLink Live TV, looking at different stations, favoriting stations, looking at the EPG guide, 
um, if I go, if from this screen I can click the right arrow and you can look at the EPG single, which shows you for this TV channel, channel number 133 on Bravo right now, what is coming up for shows. If I go left, I can see what's coming up the next day on Saturday and go right, I can surf down to the time slot that I'm looking for, right? So I click exit, it comes back to the next screen or the, the screen before. And this is a way in how you serve Dreamlink, really easy. The remote makes it really easy to favorite stations and um, enjoy your many hours of entertainment watching live TV.